Hello everyone, welcome back to Ogo Power. I'm Ogo and this is another episode of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I wanted to say something else and I don't know why. Um, let's... Sigrid. I expect my son to act like the future king, not roll in the muck. So Flan will take you on as his farting court jester. Think with your head and not your arse. Flan can assure my throne, which will one day be yours. That makes you the ass. Enough! Eivor, my son, Sigfrith. I'm sorry, I... I must clear my head. Could you speak to the boy? Well, let's talk to him. I was looking forward to meeting my cousin's son. So, you're the cousin who does speak so fondly of. Is the old fool reduced to importing Vikings now? In Norway, you'd be knocked to the ground by now. Come yes. on then. If you have any guts worth respecting. Fine, Welp. Okay. You won't land a single punch. He hit me. You don't understand. He hit me. I didn't want him to even touch me. Bastard. I guess I owe you thanks for not beating me, bloody. I am not here to quarrel with you, Sigfrith. Da speaks so highly of you. I wanted to see if you lived up to the stories. Does anyone? You're unhappy with how your father rules. Da has the makings of a fine king, but he chooses to play the unctuous merchant instead. A visit to Norway might do a young vikinger like you some good. I'd love to go with Da. Maybe the homeland would kindle his warrior spirit. Give Dublin a fair and fearsome king. Interesting. It's not really against him. I've lost track of your father. Any idea where he might be? He wanted to clear his head. That means he's visiting grandfather's grave. Da has a chat with him almost every day. Bareth can commune with the dead. <laughs> no, his conversations are all one-sided. The grave sits at the top of the hill. I'll find him. Thank you, Sigfrith. Eivor! Teach me how to hit like that sometime. We will. Well, I guess we were here. There? <laughs> so, loot the chest. Get the stuff. Oh, I need a key. Okay. I guess that's... I did see... Where did I see that, that key? stuff like that when I can. Uh, okay, 
this is a bit far, uh, farther off than I would have thought it would be. Okay. Okay. How do you get in there? Ah, maybe it's not about getting in, but That helped in any way, shape, or form. Like a pool. Okay, yeah, that's, that's interesting. Some clothing. An opal. Multiple. <laughs> Uh, okay, interesting. So, and are you... Yeah, the lake chest key. I think I need those for fishing, but I could be wrong about that. Yeah, I will get the platinum trophy one day. All of that for tungsten. Oh well, could be worse. So uh, it is a top. So either here or there, I think. Ah, there you are. <laughs> Beautiful tribe. Or no. <laughs> yeah, as a photo. Oh, my rations are full, okay. Um, just so that it... Um, doesn't confuse me. Ah, there he is. Barth. Huh. Why so uneasy? <sighs> A king must forever be on guard. When I'm upset or uncertain, I come here to seek my father's spirit. I didn't even ask after him. Somehow I knew he'd... Some years ago, he was destined to die in battle, and he did. He sits with Odin now. My family owes yours a solemn debt. That winter, your family came to stay with us. I remember your birth. Screaming like a warrior. The plague year. No one would take us in. No one but your mother and father. I owe your family my life. And what a life we had. I have fond memories of you and I slipping out to hunt. In dead of <laughs> night. Stars in the sky. Moonlight on snow. It seems like they had a lot of fun together and enjoyed <laughs> it all a lot. <laughs> and that's how I got that scar. <laughs> I 
I do feel bad about that. What about the one on your cheek? This. A caution from the gods about my vanity. Come. If we tell all our stories, we'll be here a week. Do you see something? My imagination drawn amok, but let us away. The fuck? Funny how just the slightest noise sets a fellow on edge. By Thor's hammer about it. I could sleep a week. Not as spry as the old days, eh? When we'd search the night in hopes of catching a will-o'-the-wisp. <laughs> Did we catch one? I have a memory of catching mm. one. Good doggy. Who were they? My ascension to the throne has not been without contest. The previous king's son, Thorstein, is resentful. You told me nothing of this. You are my guest. I'm not going to burden you with petty concerns. Petty concerns? I now know why you've been anxious all evening. I. It is worrying. He's never been so bold before. He sees you as a usurper to his throne. Perhaps, but he doesn't seem to want to take it. He contents himself by stealing and smuggling with his band of ruffians. It's petty Viking raiding, but it puts me in a bad light with Flan. That's certain. Keep a sharp watch. Brigands rove the streets tonight. You can be sure of me, my king. Interesting language. Gaelic? Uh, maybe it was Gaelic, I don't know. What? You know I am always the last to leave a party. What is wrong? We were ambushed by Thorstein's men. Rivals I was not made aware of. Small wonder King Flan does not embrace you, Barret. You cannot keep control of the Vikings in your own city. Thorsten makes me look like more of an arse than I do on my own. I see. It is the High King's disfavor that makes this shameful. My cousin, I will take care of Thorstein. No, I do not want to drag you into this sorry mess. Perhaps you'll accept silver to lie low. For a week mm. or two. But then he'll be back and yep. back again. I can remove this blood once and for all. Eivor, this is not your fight. For any and all of your gods' sakes, Barith, let Eivor help you. As of this moment, Barith, my arm is yours. Whatever is needed to bring Flan's smile upon you, I will do. Eivor, I have never been so happy. Your family saved mine those years ago. A fitting reply would be to secure your throne. I will start with Thorstein. It happens that Siegfried may know something. He once ran with Thorstein's gang. Sadly true. Seek him tomorrow in the marketplace. After a night of carousing, he likes to recuperate there. We will begin to forge a bond with High King Flan on Rise of Sun. Sigfrith would be at the marketplace. I need to learn more about Thorstein. Um, but before we go well, for that one, oh, it's really close. I think I will go and do some stuff around Dublin. Snaring Thorstein. <laughs> What? 
Okay, Shapeyard. Um, Raven Clan, Wanderlust, Berserker. Nice combination of uh, Berserker and, and uh, Yum's Viking stuff. The other side must be barred. Okay, so Eerie, we have to get in there, or we can. So, um, can I? No, I cannot auto assign the points. Interesting. Uh, and yeah, just to have them active. I should not be seen in this area. We will see about that. There. these two up as well. Hey, what? Bye bye. Hey. Oh. Oops. That was the wrong one. But that's not too bad. Oh. Okay, what do you want? Fifty delicacies. Loafing, foreign supplies. I don't even have one. Well, technically, there is a trader close by to our next story mission, so I will maybe just try to talk to. What? Yeah. 
You might also hear the pug sleeping. He's snoring in the background, the little one. How cute, the little one. I see you. lines interesting and uh, I don't know if um, if Dublin was really a city made by Vikings it would be interesting I've never heard of that. Silver. Oh, uh, could you please go away and show me what I found? Clothing, clothing, clothing. Okay. Um, I could raid the Abbey, uh, but not not in this one. That, that seven eight minutes is. A Bit on the low side for something along those lines. Oh, I will just ride a bit. I have a feeling that I will need it, so that's why I'm going for it. Bandit cave door key. Pressure horde map. Okay. A lot of I don't know what opal silver and <sighs> the thing is even if I look at whatever there is, it still says says then like um that the message doesn't go away. It will come again and again. And that's a bit on the disappointing side. Beautiful. Well, but 
island is supposed to be a very, 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 very beautiful island, so I guess this shouldn't be as much of a, I wouldn't say shock, but um, as surprising as this might seem. I only saw pictures of Ireland and I do know like the occasional movie that was uh, made there. So I don't know not a lot about Ireland. I think, come to think of it, uh, former friends of mine do know, did know, uh, well maybe still do know a lot about it, but that's been quite some time. Quite some time ago. Oh god. Oh no, please, no, no, oh freak, oh no. I hate it. Destroy stuff. <sighs> nope. Bye. It's really that I just, at the beginning, I liked them because they were like a, a little fun little challenge. By now, I, I, I really like, um, I wish they didn't put it into the game. In all honesty, it's not a joke or anything. I really do think that the game would be better without them. And I don't care if this is like uh, something um, uh, insensitive. I'm sorry if it's if 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 uh, the current storms are some something that's uh, cultural or or something along those lines. I'm re I really am. I I don't mean it in in an offensive way along the, those lines. I don't want. I don't think that the how should I say uh, that the prospect of the stones is back? It's just the way they implemented it. I just don't like it. Well, at least this one was a fast one. Thanks for the skill point. I really 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 don't enjoy this i have to say not even a little bit Okay, so then I'd say let's fast travel back to you and uh, I think then we will start uh, stop this episode. So I want to thank you guys very much for watching and hope to see all of you again in the next episode. Bye bye.